No, cada uno por un lado. Observers feel that Simeone's Atletico have got the measure of Real Madrid. It's always a tight clash indeed. The players greeting each other, a fantastic atmosphere. I'm joined here. Bale finds Isco. Isco quick to get Ronaldo on things. Actually, 350 Real Madrid fans in the stadium, but 900 security staff with it being high risk. So, just around three security staff for every Madrid fan officially in the stadium. Fan fan there. I think if that had been slightly later in the game, that may well have been a booking on for Gareth Bale. I think you may be right. Isco really involved for Madrid in these opening minutes. That's good news. Here's Marcelo with the cross. Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, Black keeps it away. And somehow they managed to put it wide. Right. Now Ronaldo's claiming the ball went over the line. And I must admit, Lucas, live, it looks as though Cristiano Ronaldo might have a point. I really agree with you, sir, but I think that he goes down. A black was back off the line from that angle. It's a brilliant cross from Marcelo. And the way he rises above Godin. Couldn't get the rebound in. That's not the greatest. Uh, Atletico have got a lot to thank or black for. Let's look at it again. Well, again, that's uh, not conclusive, is it? It was a really mistaken misjudgment of the flight of the ball by Diego Godin, who normally so powerful in the air. Just demonstrates what a brilliant header of the ball Cristiano Ronaldo is. He's disappointed with the decision. I think we have to say that we give the referee the benefit of the doubt on that decision. Having seen the replays we've seen, I'm sure we'll see many more from different angles uh, over the next uh, hour or so, and over the next few days, no doubt, especially if it's a decisive... Madrid, Atletico looking very confident in the first few minutes, Madrid starting to fight back, this is Ronaldo, bustled off the ball by Gavin, not too happy there, not to be given a free kick, it's Madrid, Gareth Bale to take it, Gareth Bale, Ronaldo, Ronaldo caught from behind by Gavin, Bale's a free kick to Atletico, Isco to Ronaldo, Savage there to cover, and that will be a throw into Atletico, it clearly came off Ronaldo, the referee. Helder on the spot in behind. Can Ronaldo break the deadlock? It took a nasty deflection and he can! Ronaldo puts it in the back of the net. I think it went through the wall there, Lucas. Certainly took a deflection and went and put it on black. Real Madrid, halfway through the first half, almost exactly, take the lead 1 0. And to be quite honest, you have to say they deserve it. No, it certainly has been coming. And of course, that man there, he thought he'd scored earlier in the game, could have got a slice of luck on this occasion. We'll wait and see the replay who it came off, but it didn't look like it was going to be. Have too much power, Black would have had it covered. I think the deflection, though, completely fooling the keeper there. I think it comes off Savage, uh, and I think we can say it comes off his hip. Just going through there between Gabby and Savage, it comes off uh, his left hip. The deflection, completely wrong footing. Jano Black, Real Madrid, won't care. into the arms of Kayla Navas and there's the man Cristiano Ronaldo who's uh, broken this deadlock here, he wins a throw in puts out Marcelo on the left again plenty of space for Marcelo he finds Ronaldo Bale making a run 
forward, Bale getting on the end of it. Here's Isco. Isco, lovely ball through to Ronaldo. Ronaldo he did everything right. The ball just got away from him and he couldn't get any uh, power behind the shot. But it was a lovely turn. And what brilliant play again by Isco. Perfectly weighted ball in. Ronaldo, I think, just lost his footing a little bit as he turned. Good opportunity there for Real Madrid to extend their lead. There was a really good move in Isco, as we've been mentioning throughout this. Up. And there's that earlier turn, the brilliant ball into the box by Isco. And I think Ronaldo on his uh, supporting foot, the left one there, just lost his footing a little bit, or maybe got his studs just caught. He couldn't quite... Get the home fans staying with the with Atletico and really creating a good atmosphere, but Real Madrid standing up well to it. Ronaldo tries to go a little bit too far, wins a free kick, however, a combination between... Short, Griezmann and Torres doing their best, trying to find positions, but they just haven't had the final ball. Well, it's uh, some tremendous work there from Chris, Cristiano Ronaldo, who says Ronaldo doesn't put in a shift at the back. Certainly took the ball off Koke there. And wins a felt. Because after the opening 45 minutes here, in the final ever Liga Santander derby between Atletico and Real Madrid, then the Vicente Calderon 1-0 ahead. Cristiano... Well, certainly recent season when sitting back. There's Isco, little cheeky attempt by Ronaldo. He didn't quite get the contact he wanted. And I think it's probably offside anyway. And the wrong option of block down the break. Isco gave the ball away there to Carrasco, but uh, got back and took him off, took it off him again. Here's Marcelo floating it in towards Gareth Bale. He does well to get to it. Ronaldo. And a little bit of handbags there between Ronaldo and Coque. And it's Coque who gets a yellow card and Ronaldo too. Diego Bobin acting the peacemaker there, Gareth Bale held up because he's really heavily involved in this game. And uh, there have been times this season where he's a little bit annoyed with Coque and vice versa. And uh, the majority of Atletico's shots come from that distance, but as you say, positive movement, good forward move, good forward run there. Well, he's got Haynes interception. It appeared to come off. About three or four pretty blatant fouls going on in the penalty area there. Ronaldo chasing this, gets the better of Savage. He's pulled down. The referee points to the spot. Seeing it live, no doubt whatsoever about that one. Cristiano Ronaldo, whatever you say, is proving absolutely crucial in the derby in the Calderon. Yeah, he's got the better of Savage there, out muscled him. And the defender ball him down, we'll see the replay to see exactly what contact there was, but I agree with you, Simon, that was a penalty from up here. Well, there you can see, it's a clumsy challenge, he's on the ground, he just loses his foot in there, maybe the complaint is that Ronaldo gave him a little bit of a nudge just there, the referee waves play on, and really, Ronaldo stumbles over the prone Savage there, and, uh, to be quite honest, if he doesn't come to the spot, I don't think there can be too many complaints either. Seeing it again, that's a soft one. And Simeone, quality. Someone's been booked for Atletico in the... Meanwhile, Diego Modin for descent. Ronaldo against Gianna Black. No mistake at all. It's 2-0 to Real Madrid. Cristiano Ronaldo, I'm not sure if that goes down as a very brief mannequin challenge or not, but the celebration shows really the importance of the goal. It's Atletico Madrid 0, Real Madrid 2, Cristiano Ronaldo with his second of the night. Then he's equal out further to Stefano's record of goals in derbies with that penalty. And whilst you may say it was a soft one, I don't disagree, Simon, but... Stefan Savic perhaps should have been stronger as well. He got whether he got pulled over. He's a, a physical centre half, and he just should have been stronger. Knew Ronaldo was behind him. He should have just seen that ball away, really. But in the end, he gave the referee a choice to make Savic by being allowed to be pulled over, perhaps.
Cristiano Ronaldo, the thinker. And, uh, well, that's uh, going to get uh, a lot of repeats, that particular celebration of the Portuguese superstar. I agree with you, Lucas. To me, the fault was savage, and I don't think he can complain too much because he went down, lost control, and Ronaldo ran him through performance. It's not a fluke for 2 0 up. No, his um, tactics working very well. And this could be more danger. Gareth Bale getting on the end of this one. A cross into Ronaldo! It's a hat trick for Cristiano Ronaldo! And Bale clearly is a mannequin challenge that time. It's a challenge to the home fans of the Vicente Calderon. Whenever anybody dares to even hint of writing Ronaldo off, or even hint that he's getting towards the end of uh, his career, off he comes with yet another hat trick in enemy territory. It's Cristiano Ronaldo 3, Atletico 0. And it all starts once again with Isco. Beautiful ball clear, played on by Gareth Bale. Bale totally aware of the presence of Ronaldo. Ronaldo showing that he can still sprint, and the finish is as easy as pie. Certainly is great for Misco, and as you've said before, we haven't seen that much of Bale, but proving very effective there. And I just mentioned the 4-0 record victory, and now they're only one goal away from it. Just demonstrating once again, even if he may have lost a bit of that electric pace of uh, the last few seasons, or the last many seasons, uh, there are very few players more clinical than Cristiano Ronaldo in front of goal. Points. 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 Points.